Welcome back guys, this is Goddess Nicole Tarot, back to bring you another energetic read for the collective, for my beautiful and handsome soul tribe members. How are you guys doing? It's Friday. We made it guys, I hope all is well, I hope your overall health is doing good. With that being said, thank you for the continuous love and the support that you show me in the channel. Thank you for the super thanks, thank you for the um just the gifts to paypal and cash out thank you guys so very much i appreciate each and every one of you guys i promise you it does not go unnoticed the appreciation thank you guys so very much with that being said if you're new here welcome to the soul tribe if you're returning and you're my ogs you've been with me for a while welcome back guys and if you just stop in by the view to the message and if it clicks or resonates with you go ahead and be pump, become a part of the soul tribe we would love to have you over here okay uh with that being said keep in mind i can't be loud on this channel i also can cry on this channel i also can use profanity from time to time it all depends on what energies i pick up on what energies i embody the channel messages the channel songs they all play a part over here we're getting the messages out there to you guys okay when I came out of meditation and prayer, I was shuffling through one of my new decks here. Um, the Six of Wands pops out, okay? This is an indication of a setback or fall from grace, failure, okay? It also can in, uh, indicate that someone is not getting recognized for their achievements, okay? This is an ego dying too as well. So this could be a Leo fire sign energy okay six of wands in the reverse someone is having a major setback here guys okay i don't know what it is when it comes to, to somebody getting negative attention or whatever it is something is going on with this person okay something is stalled out for this person okay they not have some major major losses here okay when it comes to their achievements or things that they're being recognized maybe this person it feels like a failure whoever this is okay we're gonna get started but first i'm gonna get a prayer holy spirit of the highest white light protect me and protect my collective as i tap into the energies anything that is not of you i ask that you close and shut that portal shut that door don't allow any negative energy to impact the reading okay thank you god and we love you over here so this could be a leo or this could be somebody here all the attention that this person once had it has left them in a failing position so this could have been somebody that's trying to get attention but they are getting negative attention constantly Whoever this is. So somebody just like, oh yeah, wow. Judgment, five of wands, and the will of fortune in the reverse. That is failure to me. This is gossip. This is slander. This is someone not answering the call. They're not resurrecting. This is someone that's in their shadow side 24 7, seven days a week. This is someone that's still asleep. This is also somebody who wants to put down the conflict. Or this is somebody that could have possibly been in competition with you or wants to reconcile with you, okay? This is somebody that could have been fighting against you, could have tried to ruin your reputation, but this person's reputation got ruined. They brought attention to themselves. They brought setback, delays to themselves, okay? They're under judgment for gossip, slander, lies, jumping on the bandwagon, whatever it is. Heavy fire sign energy here, okay? Will of Fortune here. Sagittarius, Leo, Taurus, Scorpio. <clears throat> Whoever is in this Will of Fortune energy here, okay? Somebody feels like a failure. It's a lot of change coming with this person. <sighs> They're not answering the call. They don't get a fortune. They are unlucky here. This is a fallen destiny for somebody wow so they're unfortunate and that's sad wow tell us more here five of swords in the reverse 
It want to come up. It came want to come up in the upright because somebody still probably has that on their mind. Trying to win at all costs here. <clears throat> trying to sabotage or bring conflict to someone. We got five, five here. So fives are about change. Okay, it represents change, but somebody is refusing to do that. And this is why they're so unlucky. They could be going through karma. Okay, with this wheel changing the way it is, it's a lot of people are facing that, that type of energy, that upheaval, that change because of reckless energy. Okay, we got the Ten of Pentacles. Somebody done lost their inheritance. Someone still has a curse. This could be a family on somebody's bloodline here. Ten of Pentacles is just a financial financial loss. This is the bad side of wealth. Somebody could be facing financial issues. Yeah, because they're, they're deception. Seven of Swords. Wow. Let's see. Yeah, they're thinking about this. They're in thought. They're in contemplation. Like, where did I go wrong in my life? This is what somebody's asking themselves or trying to think of uh, what went wrong. They're in deep contemplation. Somebody may not, not be able to sleep at night because, or somebody is trying to rest and recover from this. Whatever this is, it's bad. They're in thought about it. Yeah, three of wands, more delay, more delays. This is poor preparation and planning here, okay? This is not having foresight. Not somebody's ships is not coming in. Ooh, this could be a financial downfall. Something is spiraling out of control here. For someone. Who's in this energy, Spirit? For the collective. Who's in this energy? Ten of Swords. I'm telling you, this is painful. This is painful. Whoever this is, somebody. This is definitely a painful ending. Because someone thought, show they was going to have fortune. They were going to have the attention or be publicly recognized for their achievements. But that failed. This is failure energy too. This is backstabbing, being betrayed. Ten of swords or hex or curse, like I said. Somebody don't get their bloodline inheritance from the most high because somebody is still asleep. They they refuse to rise to the occasion. That's what I'm hearing. And this is why they having bad luck, misfortunes in life. People are backstabbing this person, betraying this person, and they're in deep thought. They thinking about this. Page of Wands in a reverse. Heavy fire sign energy out here, guys. Yeah. A lot of people are in their head right now. And they're barely holding on with the four of pentacles here. Out of greed, jealousy, and angry energy here. Somebody was trying to betray someone. Maybe this person got betrayed in the re in, in return. Something happened here. Somebody's getting bad news. <clears throat> this is immaturity. This is um with the page of wands in the reverse, it's like someone likes that type of attention. They like to be negative, okay? They have a negative mindset, a way of thinking, the swords of minds here. This person thinks about 24 hours, seven days a week of betraying, stabbing somebody in the back. They have negative thoughts. And this when you have negative thoughts, you're going to have negative outcomes each and every time. Three of swords. This could be somebody you at a distance from that's thinking like this. Wow. This person could be losing a job for, yeah, knight of swords. What's this knight of swords here? What is the knight of swords here? Who's this knight of swords? Attacking about somebody, somebody attacked somebody's finances, and this is what they're getting back in return. Ten of Pentacles in the reverse. Okay, somebody did something wrong. And this is why they're going through this. This could be a fire sign. This could be an air sign or, or, or uh earth sign here. Yeah. 
Emperor in the reverse. It came out with the Ten of Pentacles in the reverse. This is who a narcissistic energy here did this to someone, attacked somebody's finances. And this is the result of that. Them falling from grace. Because this person wanted to bring some type of painful ending to someone's finances, somebody's stability, somebody's notoriety here, somebody in the public. Somebody is getting negative attention now that this person could have once got positive attention, but not, not anymore. This person that lost their stability, could have lost their family for being selfish, self-centered, only caring about themselves. That's the emperor in the reverse. This is someone who is childish, immature. They don't have control over anything. This is someone who is greedy. This is someone who is angry, upset. They get offended when you try to tell them what's going on in their life that they need to fix. This is someone who don't listen and they're still asleep. This is someone who is in a deep thought about what they did to somebody. Yeah, this person lives at a distance from somebody. It's probably because of a third party that this person is like this. In this situation right now, this is current energy. Somebody wants to say, I'm sorry. Wow. Mm, 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 mm. Yeah, for trying to hold you back or stop your love offers, stop you from moving forward. This is somebody that would do this. This is someone who is sick in the head, whoever this person is. This is somebody you could have healed from. Yeah, this person slandered you. What did I say about gossip and slander? told multiple lies and now people are viewing this emperor in the reverse Aries energy, big Aries energy Libra energy, Gemini, Libra Aquarius, this person is in their head because this person thinks negative and they're going to have negative results they think about sabotaging somebody people just don't know your thoughts is your actions, okay what you manifest in your mind is actually going to happen to you. If you wishing bad or wishing bad on somebody's finances, somebody's love life, somebody's stability, their home life, this is what you're going to have in return. Stuck, delayed, not being able to move forward. You receiving negative energy because that's what you are. You're negative. You're thinking negative. Your actions are negative. This is what you're going to reap. You're going to reap. You're going to reap what you sow. And this person is doing that. Telling lies. This person has a blocked intuition. They don't get the success here. They don't get publicly recognized here for any achievements. But a liar, deceptor, thief, <coughs> a cheater. And somebody else gets to move forward. Maybe this has been discovered. What's this chariot energy? Wow, magic. Or somebody's having the tools to able to manifest. Somebody could have manifested recent a new car and somebody is pissed about it. Somebody didn't know you was the magician. You can manifest anything in your life, okay? <clears throat> this is taking action. This is you standing up for what it is that you want and going after it, being successful, having the willpower. Cancer, Gemini energy here. Somebody could have been doing spell work on somebody's vehicle. Wow. This person was doing a lot. Seven of cups in the reverse, but they're getting a sudden realization, a huge reality check. That what goes around comes around. What's what goes up must come down. I always say that they did this on a, a lover's connection, a twin flame, out of jealousy, envy, negative thoughts, negative actions. This is what you get. This emperor did this on somebody here because he couldn't let something go. Okay, it could let go something from the past this person is holding on to. They're angry. They're upset. This is a player energy. 
and got upset that somebody walked out of their life to go store it over, to store it fresh. You utilize the tools that the master, the creator of the universe gave this person. And somebody got upset because they walked, to, they chose to leave this mess behind. And somebody took it upon themselves to go sabotage somebody's relationship, somebody's marriage, affect somebody's finances, the stability, all because of something was not going right for them in their life. They wasn't achieving anything in their life. This is a failure energy. This is a broken boy inside. Whoever this 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 um, emperor ear, this person, it could be male or female. Flip the roles, please, because I feel like some of you guys in my comments be having trouble with that. Flip the roles to fit your situation. This is energy. It could be anyone, okay? Whoever this is, this person suffers from abandonment issues, childhood trauma, repressed emotions. They can't take no for an answer. This is someone that will not stop until they be satisfied. This is someone who promiscuous. They fall the streets. They're jealous. They're envious. They're angry. They're reckless. They all of that. This person is bitter about somebody's relationship, about a twin flame connection, and about a cycle completing out. I cannot make it up. And somebody else is achieving what they want. And this person can't. Who's achieving in this energy here, spirit? Yeah, somebody is moving forward. Yeah. This is planning and preparation. This is travel. Somebody is able to travel now. Somebody tried to restrict somebody's car. Somebody wanted somebody to be down on their luck and not have a vehicle to go as they please. Somebody is mad because somebody just recently got a truck. That's what I'm here. We got the Pisces in the reverse. Somebody can't surrender. They cannot. This is someone that not getting the perspective that they need. This is more reckless energy. This is more bad behavior. Emotionally distraught, emotionally distorted. Whoever this person is, this masculine is mad at somebody from their past. They got a lot of resentment. King of Pentacles. Death in the reverse. Two of swords. What is this? Four cups in the reverse. Feeling rejected. Not willing to change who they are. Put down old habits. Stop old patterns. This is someone that sees what they are. They know what they do. They don't care. This is someone refusing. That's why they have a lot of inner conflict. A lot of repressed emotions, a lot of damage. This is someone that had a stalemate. They made this decision because of out of meanness and hatefulness. This is a bitter ass man. Whoever this is, attack someone's finances over and over. And this is why they broke. They know, they can see. They being rejected because of this. Nobody wants this person's offer at all. This Somebody left this tool of connection with this person out in the cold. I cannot with men. I cannot. They just as jealous as women. That's ridiculous. <laughs> yeah, this person is, cannot get themselves back balanced. They cannot. <laughs> Two of Pentacles in the reverse. It's just telling me that this person juggles people a lot. Juggles situations in their life a lot. They don't take anything serious. Two of Pentacles in the reverse. Oh, it fell on top of the night of um, wands in the reverse. They don't take shit serious. They're immature and, and childish. And broke here. They like to team up and do shit. Oh, this is who they did this to. Hmm. Queen of Swords. Somebody that putting up that boundaries from their ass. That could have juggled this woman. Yeah, she came out anyway. I cannot make it up. Come through spirit. This is someone that's refusing to pull up with this childish ass, immature, broke ass. People seeing this motherfucker as a negative Nancy, a negative Betsy. This person could also be having an identity crisis too because only bitch maids niggas do this to women. I don't understand. I, I don't get that. I really don't. This is the energy I'm picking up. Who raised you? 
Oops, you sour ass nigga. You are so mad that this man, this woman is able to manifest anything that she wants. New beginnings, fresh starts. She has divine coverage. This is divine inheritance too as well. She get to have whatever she wants. And somebody is watching you at a distance thrive here, Queen of Cups, Queen of Swords, in secret. You could give mental clarity. You could give guidance here. And you could be celebrating right now, Queen of Swords, Queen of Cups. I just feel like you are in hermit bowl. You're, you could be relaxing too. You could be resting too. I feel like you you receive your downloads and your guidance from the Most High. And Most High tell you when to move. You could be moving, you know, secretly here. You don't tell people or disclose information or disclose information to people. People don't know how you move. And they should mind the business that pay them. Yeah, this person is sour that you don't want their ass no more. And that's just period. Yeah, Knight of Cups in the reverse. You could be highly intuitive. Page of Cups. Well, one of your children is. Okay, take it however it resonates. You turn down this person's offer. Like I said, this person could be on the down low. They like to partner up. And have sex with men and women. You already know this. Okay? Yeah, they do. What did I say? Third party energy here. And it fell right on top of the Knight of Wands and the uh, Ace of Wands. So this person likes to screw women and men. I told you they suffer when I did crisis. A crisis. Okay? They don't know what they want. This is someone distorted, and they face a lot of inner, inner conflict. Nine of swords in the reverse, and you release that. You release this stress, this anxiety, anything that's having to do with this person here. Yeah, and you started elsewhere. Could have started another family because you're not hurt by this person anymore. And you know they did some unjust shit to you, some unfair shit. The truth ain't in this person. They don't live by the truth. They live by lies. Ace of swords in the reverse. And trying to do negative shit to people behind the scenes. This is a hating ass nigga. 2222. That you don't want them no more. And things are looking up for you. Okay? Divine feminine, divine masculine. Flip the rose. Yeah. My divine empress. I can't make it up. Queen of cups, queen of swords. And that's just facts. Somebody's just pissed. That you don't want to team up or work with them anymore. And they do shit behind the scenes. I cannot make this up. To destroy your happiness. What you are manifesting. This is divine connections. This is happiness. This is complete fulfillment. Somebody hates that. That you take care of your family. You could be the breadwinner. And they're so confused as to why this magic is not working on you. This person knows trouble is coming their way. Karma is coming their way. And they're fucked up in the head. Whoever this person is. That is ridiculous. Let's get my other cards here. This is trifling. This is a man attacking a woman over and over. Attacking her happiness. Her, um, her relationships. Her family. Could be attacking her job. Could be attacking her psychic abilities. Whatever it is, she's manifesting. This person is attacking it. If she has a spiritual business, this person attacks it from behind the scenes. That's why this motherfucker ain't got shit now. This could be a warlike energy here. A clout chaser. A, someone who is very materialistic. Shallow, okay? Superficial. Surface level. This person don't have an ounce of love in them and they don't have any control. This is a not so divine master. At all. This person's not divine. They hating on the divine feminine. They come through spirit. I can't make it up. This person betrayed you. Juggled you. Mistreated you. Now they hate that you getting good news. And they're getting bad news. I cannot with people. I cannot stop watching this person. Sent you death magic. I told you. Wanted to bring a painful ending to you. Hex accursed you with death magic. This is sad. Whoever this man is did this to a divine feminine. Queen of Swords, Queen of Cups. Mm, mm, mm. Did love spells, death magic. They did everything 
to get you to come back and fall in that fucking trap again with their despicable ass, whoever this is. They don't have any home training. This is someone that could have been taught this magic in their bloodline. This is why their bloodline cursed. We got 10 and 10 here. Something is over. So something else can begin. And this person is so fucking confused that you don't want to be a part of this person's plan or their options. They're so confused here. We got five, five. What else this person did here? Yeah. You got your boundaries up. You don't have no more love for this person at all. And they're so upset that you're cold to them. You won't let them in. You won't allow them to do you any kind of fucking way. Yeah, because you're the high priestess. I can't make it up. Fell right on top of the empress. You know what this fucking person, this fuck nigga do? This is fuck boy energy. You know, I don't sugarcoat it. I don't sugarcoat it. Somebody, yeah, they wanted you to be stuck to them. Come through spirit. They did that too. Binding spells. Bonding spells to bind you to them so they can have. They ain't got shit without your energy. I mean, this is just merely confirmation for some of you guys that this person did spell work on you and your faith kept you alive. Your connection to source, divine intervention is here. Your faith kept you alive here because you're single and successful and you're able to manifest. Come through spirit. Some of you guys recently manifested a car. I know I did. This could very well be my reading. I got hating ass, shasty ass, family members, ex and everybody. I don't give no fucks. Because I worked my ass off of this. And I'm quite sure that it goes for you too, collective. My soul tribe family. Y'all feel me? Stop playing on my top. Because my faith is real strong. I'm able to take it. I'm connected to source. And I'm unfucking bothered. I know a lot of y'all are. You ain't got no love for this motherfucker that dogged you out, juggled you, had you in third parties options. You're not a fucking because you're the star. I'm telling you, big Aquarius energy. Something to do with the number 86 can 1986 can be significant. 1981, 1977, 1992, 1995, 90. Somebody could be 46, 37, 64, 73 could be significant. 1973, 41 could be significant. 43. This very well could be my reading. I see all my numbers here, child. It's just, it's just real. This person is real, real salty that all this spell work, all this hard work they put into this spell work, trying to bond you to them, has left them broke, busted, you know, broken. Their finances is in the shitter. They're in their head. I told you this person is in deep thought contemplation because this was supposed to work on you. Death magic was supposed to work on you. Love spells was supposed to work on you. Them binding, binding up your money or binding or bonding them to you was supposed to work. That didn't work. Because you are a star here. You're a star C and you are the divine takes care of you. And your faith is strong. That's why they couldn't fuck with you. They stop playing. Somebody need to sit down. Yeah. And you see straight through the veil. You know who this is. Somebody could be 65 or 56 here. Somebody could be 27, 47. <clears throat> and you know this motherfucker lustful. This is a lust demon. Something is attached to this person that desires your light. Your chosen energy. Okay? Do not accept this person, Divine Feminine, at all for anything. Nothing. Because this is what all they did to you. And now they got to lay that shit to rest because it's starting to affect them and people around them. I tell you, when you do that death magic, them love spells, you better be prepared for what's going to happen to your ass next. Try to fight somebody or bond somebody's free will up. Do spell work on their money, their finances, their love life, their children, their, they, they, their fertility. All this shit. This person did this. This master. That's who did it. Yeah. 
out. Look where he's at now. Broke and disgusted. What did I say? This person ain't got no fucking job. At all. Doing shit to your relationships. I said that. Tell us more here, Steve. Sure. And waiting around and watching. Expect for something to happen. Baby, you'll be sitting there forever. Because this woman is protected. You'll be sitting there forever. I cannot with people. I cannot. I just can't. They was expecting something to happen to you by now. Queen of Swords, Queen of Cups, Empress, Divine Feminine, High Priestess. Damn. Whew. This, this judgment, this karma is going to be so hard, hard for this person. Because they just can't let something go. They can't let bygones be bygones. They cannot just let the fact of you leaving this person behind and closing this chapter. They can't accept that this is really over, baby. It is over. It is over. She is never coming back to you. I'm never coming back to you. The collective is not. Okay? Somebody needs to realize that. It's never going to happen because of all the shit that you did to try to make it happen, that shit backfired because this woman knows self-love. She's went through self-healing. She's healed from you. Three of sources out here in the reverse. You no longer have access. You no longer are a trauma to her. She's not your trauma. You better face that up with God. Yeah. Yeah. Distant future. You will not distort her pathway. You will not get in between her at all. Tell us more here, Spirit. Mm. Yeah. Or her love life. Period. Her twin flame. Jezebel. That's why you are not achieving anything. Six of Wands is out here in the reverse. Because you, you listen to a Jezebel? Or you are the Jezebel? That's an emotional distraught now, right now. You're in emotional pain. You're losing everything because of these lust demons that you're attached to. Wow. Whew. A third party. You're attached to a third party that 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 really got you, you know, juiced up here to do all of this shit to somebody. Now both of y'all are looking stupid. Ooh, I cannot. Looking real stupid. Woe out. Bad health. Drained. Financially drained. Sick. Because you can't stop this twin flame. Period. It's going to happen. The high priestess and the high priest is out here. And the divine supports this. Okay? You cannot stop this with no death magic, blood spell, because these people are protected out here. They are. They are protected out here. These love offers is in the reverse. You're not going to get this woman or this man back. Okay, Jezebel. You're not going to get that. It's an ending for you. Period. Point blank. A permanent ending. Yeah. And you're not and you're not and you're not going to take this person's innocence or affect this person's child either. Some of you guys are supposed to have a child, a divine child, with your high priestess or your high priest. Taking however resonate, divine feminine, divine masculine. Okay? What's this child here? I just feel like some some people, this person is getting negative heat. Right along with this third party Jezebel, because you were innocent in all of this. That's what I'm I'm pick, I'm picking up to. You're 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 being vindicated as being ended innocent you did nothing to these people this is sad yeah divine masculine and divine feminine is in their north no and they both are gifts they both have gifts they see you they see straight through the veil they know what you're doing give me one more to close it out here what's their overall energy Yeah. Message. You getting the message of concern. 
You know what's finna happen to you. Yep. King of Wands. A boss figure. A failed boss. This emperor in the reverse. This king of pentacles in the reverse. And this mature woman in the reverse. That these two are sending evil eye. <laughs> I cannot with these people, y'all. I just can't. I really hope this helps someone. I hope it gives you clear and concise answers that you need. Again, this has been Goddess Nicole Tarot. Peace, love, and light to you, collective. Until next time. Bye. I stay safe and I love you guys. Take care. <laughs>